Yo, Prod family, I was literally in bed because I have an early shoot tomorrow morning, and then I heard that Drake drop. Not gonna lie, I thought it was trolls just trolling, but it's true. And whether we want to believe it or not, a few things got confirmed as canon by Drake himself. Cause look though, I made a post about Drake feeding false information to Kendrick's camp about the baby and everybody was like, it's already gotten proven that it was false, that that didn't happen. But in this song, he mentioned it a few times that, hey, we done gave y'all some fake information for you to post. Now again, you might say, uh, nah, he's capping for the gram, whatever the case may be, but it's still part of their official canon now because this is what he's saying he did. Also the cover art being day free, liking a post of the children to confirm some things. Hey, it doesn't confirm that he is the baby father or whatever, but it, it, it adds to the lore and the motif of what Drake is saying as possible truth. He even explains that the reason why you drop him back to back records is to cover the fact that you realize on the previous record that you dropped that you got false information in it. So you're trying to distract them with something else. Hey. W crisis management team and told him, hey, yo, bro, if you say it is, you know what I'm saying? Or if it's true, I don't know, man, but all I know is, <laughs> bro, Drake's not out of the game. It's still, the battle goes forward. The only thing that I will say right now that I dislike is the fact that he was talking about, I don't want to diss you no more. Drake, watch your fucking mouth. Watch your mouth. This beat gonna keep going until we say it's done, nigga. And he tried to hit him with the Uno reverse on some, I got your lines tapped. I'm dialed in. So who knows about who's camp? Who got the, who got some, hey, yo, somebody's profiting off of giving both of them juice. It's gotta be. It's, it ain't no way they have all this information about each other and just have kept it to themselves. Ain't no way that both camps and the rest of the artists that's jumping in on the bandwagon this hate each other so much as, and have just been playing cool for this long and all of a sudden they're like, oh, he, oh, he's down? Let me hit him while he's down. Ain't no way all these niggas hate each other that much. Yo, I know y'all gonna be like, bro, shit is whack. It's good. But listen, listen, y'all can hop off for one second and listen and, and enjoy. Because that's what I'm doing when both artists drop. If, if Kendrick drops something, I'm like, yo, this shit is heat. You feel me? If Drake drops something, that's heat. It's heat. It doesn't matter that I'm like, no, fuck that nigga. Come on. Enjoy the ride. But not the meat ride that y'all enjoying currently. All right, this shit is getting OD long, so I'm just going to sign off by saying one more thing, bro. Drake, stop talking to this man. It's not even his wife. He won't marry her. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. But he said, yo, hit me back. Now he said, if you need anything, I got you. And when I say I'm going to hit you back, I'm going to hit her. It's a safer option. <laughs> it's a lot safer. Bro, okay, yo, listen. Drop in the comments how y'all feel about this latest track. And I know it just came out, so you may not even heard it. But go on his official YouTube page to get the official source, the official version, everything like that. So you know it's not like, oh, somebody else put on some AI shit. Like, bro, go on his page and, and look at it. Look, it literally just dropped four minutes ago. Well, by the time you watch this, more than four minutes ago. But I'm on top of this thing. So now I can go back to bed. Peace.